Since the financial crisis hit, the EU has responded with more spending and more debt. It's emptied the treasuries, it's exhausted its credit, it's turned the ECB into a bad bank. And now where does it go for funds? Well, the financial transaction tax. Let's leave aside for a second the idea uh, that we can impose such, an, uh, such a tax in isolation in Europe. Let's leave aside the bankers having to pass on the cost to their customers. Ask ourselves instead, where do most financial transactions in the EU take place? They take place in the City of London. In other words, yet again, Britain is being sent the bill in order to prop up a currency which we declined to join. This has been the unhappy story of our association with the EU these past four decades. It's just like the common fisheries policy. We're expected to put more into the common pot from which others will be drawing. And those are two, the two bookends. This has a sort of manic fin de siècle feel about it. These uh, unconstrained ambitions of so many European leaders expecting the peoples to pay again and again. There will be many Caesars ere such another Julius, wrote Shakespeare in Cymbali. Britain is a world unto itself and we will nothing pay for wearing our own noses.